These are stories about life-saving technology. Help! Somebody help me! In 2021, this woman experienced every mother's nightmare. I was in the middle of cooking dinner. He had his back turned, but the way he wasn't really moving, I knew immediately that something was wrong. Brittany Ware knew it was a life or death crisis for her son, Mason. Then she remembered she had a life back. Just screaming for help. help Hoping either someone would come and help us or someone would call 911. She put the device over Mason's mouth, pulled the plunger, and then her baby began crying. Here's the one that saved Mason's life. And it's so easy, you just pop it in there and hold it, plunge down, pull it back. It's really that easy. I was able to see um, a piece of plastic. It was clear um, and, and pull it out of his mouth. In 2020, jet suit technology in the UK was demonstrated to show how it could help save lives. A first responder was able to navigate rugged terrain, difficult for wheeled vehicles or people on foot. The suit reached altitudes of 12,000 feet, and its five jet engines allowed for speeds of up to 32 miles an hour. That can make the difference for people lost, stranded, or hurt in the wilderness. In a simulated emergency, the rocket man was able to reach an injured girl in minutes. First flight in Cumbria uh, for a jet suit that's going to save lives and ease suffering, so incredible moment, truly, truly incredible moment. It's absolutely astounding how quickly we're going to be at somebody's side that needs us. In 2019, these teens designed what could be life-saving and high-tech backpacks for kids to carry in schools. It's called the Life Pack. When we explain the name of our, our Life Pack and the reason we have the why in it is was we're trying to find our why and we think that this is our why and if, if we can save one person's life, that's a good enough reason to invent a product. It's crazy that it actually is like sitting right here and like that we won and I mean, I never really saw it coming this far, but here we are. The backpack can charge your cell phone, but it's also designed to help protect its wearer from a bullet. We have 15 layers of Kevlar. Kevlar is a bulletproof, stab-proof, and fire retardant material. So, we tested the Kevlar. You've been told since kindergarten, hey, go to school, it's a safe place. And, and now, whenever you're in math class, instead of thinking of those equations up on the board, you're like, what would happen if a gunman came in that door right now? What would I do? In 2019, a hiker slipped off a cliff and was badly injured. I'm hanging off a cliff. <laughs> His Apple Watch saved the day. James Prudenciano was on a date hiking when they slipped over the edge. I'm actually holding on. This watch is right at my face and it's saying 911, what's your emergency? And I'm just like, wow, this is an angel. It's a special setting on his Apple Watch called Fall Detection. He spoke with Les Trent. Did you know about this feature? I had no idea. Really? I had no idea. So when you hear a voice, you really had no idea who was talking to you? I had no idea who was talking to me. I had no idea what the heck was going on. The watch also sent a text to his mom who was listed as his emergency contact. It even gave the exact location of the accident. Rescuers found him at the bottom of the cliff. So my back's fractured in uh, four places, and oh my, my, my ankle's uh, fractured, and then my hand's broken right now. But Oh my I, gosh, I just, whoa! Thank God I bought this thing. If I didn't have it, both of us probably would have been dead that day. I'm hanging off a cliff. In 2023, a group of Ukrainians built a vehicle to help their military fight against the Russian invasion. A volunteer organization called Hellbats invented what's called the Herkit. It's a two-person vehicle that can maneuver around difficult terrain. It also has enough room to transport wounded soldiers and get them out of harm's way quickly. While Ukraine has received military aid and equipment from around the world, this homemade vehicle was designed specifically for them and their battlefield. For Inside Edition Digital, I'm Andreas Wendel.